I was probably the best little customer for Crayola because I always wanted my crayons to look perfect, but I used them so much. Every color meant something very important to me. It was the 64 box of Crayola. My poor mother had to buy me a new box all the time because I was using the crayons everywhere. Everything was my canvas. I ran after blue many, many years ago when no one was ever going to put blue on their nails. And I did Starry Starry Night and that was the first blue, which was a very, very dark blue with um, diamond dust in it. And then I went the extreme opposite, and I did the most beautiful sea you could possibly think of, which was St. Bart's blue. And then blue took on a life of its own because not only did it make me feel tranquil and peaceful, it did the same for women all over the world, and they embraced it, you know, and then at one point I said, well, it's great for brides, it's there's something blue. And all these brides were wearing baby blue toes. Now, of course, you know, when it comes to brides, I'm always like, remember, the pictures last forever. So, you know, when you're thinking about your manny, let's use some common sense being either a French manicure or a true classic red. So that's timeless. So when you look at the pictures, you're not going to think it's dated. And what was I thinking, you know, 20 years ago when you're sitting and looking at the pictures with your own daughter? Being a native, you know, I love it more than anything else. I mean, we go away, we have a good time, but I can't wait to get home. There's something very special about this city. Manhattan to me is sugar daddy. Every single one of us needs a sugar daddy to go shopping in Manhattan. Staten Island is quite wicked. You guys are tough, you made it through, Sandy, and you're better than ever. You know the school of hard rocks, is the Bronx and everyone's talking about the Bronx because it's the new up-and-coming borough so you've got those rocks use them Brooklyn I don't have to tell you about Brooklyn guys right from Williamsburg to Park Slope to East New York you got a bouncer in every single one of us and Queens and you know the girl is from Queens is twin sweater set this is the most amazing red. And there you have your five burrows. If I don't chuckle at a color name, it's not gonna pass the test. And I could tell you names that, you know, because it would go through this whole committee. And when I did no prenup, the committee said, no way. And I said, it is such a thing. How could you say no? I said, I'm doing it. And of course, every one of my friends that were getting married would go like, huh, no prenup? Huh. I think I was able to change the world, not just New York, change the world on how they think about nail polish. I mean, now it's the fashion accessory that women cannot live without. If your nails are not well manicured, you're not dressed. You can't go on a job interview if your hands are not well manicured. So it speaks volumes. It's your calling card. People look at your hands as they look at your eyes and they look at your shoes. I mean, let's face it. You don't have to go out and buy a whole new wardrobe, but you change your nail color. You change your whole attitude. And it's the affordable luxury, and it makes us all feel like queen for a day. I mean, if you don't have a manicure, baby, you're missing out.